Hey, welcome back to another Raised by Wolves Gaming episode. Thank you so much for all the subs to our channel, for all the views on our videos, and for the likes on our videos. We really appreciate that. And today we're going to be taking a look at the How Dare You Hand Cannon. This is not the vendor roll that you can get this week, but it was a vendor roll that you could get in a previous week. I can't remember if it was two or three weeks ago. So if you like this one, I'm sorry, but you can look for it in a Vanguard package and hope you get a similar roll. Let's take a look at the perks that I have. First off, we have the True Sight, which is a nice uh, sight. Strong target acquisition, doesn't do anything negative to the stability. We have Mulligan, missing a shot, has a chance to return ammo directly to the magazine. Rifled Barrel, increased range, slower reload, which is nice because these style of hand cannons have really no base range whatsoever. And Range Finder, aiming this weapon, increases its effective range. Now this is a higher rate of fire, lower impact style of hand cannon. If you look at it by the numbers, technically this would have a faster kill time than something like a palindrome. The reason that a lot of people don't use it is the fact that this would require two headshots and a body, whereas a palindrome would only require one headshot and two bodies. Additionally, the fact that these don't have much base range pretty much makes them ineffective in the Crucible. And because there's better perks than other guns, you don't really see them much in PvE either. Shout out to Dante for giving me the idea to take this in with a Blade Dancer and Skip Grenade. So the idea here is to throw a couple Skip Grenades on somebody and then finish them off with this How Dare You Hand Cannon. So we're going to try that as we jump into Clash with the How Dare You previous vendor roll. Clash. Bravo team. Okay, here we go with a little bit of Clash on Black Shield. Gonna take this up inside here if I can. Hey, there we go. Got the first kill. Oh, got an assist on that one. I really wanted that one. Uh, trip mine. Get away. Yeah. Oh, man. There was too many of them out there. Okay, well, we know the skip grenades work. Oh, there's somebody coming behind me. I need to turn around quickly. Oh, we traded. If I got that shot on the head instead of being a potato, I probably could have took him out. Hey, got another grenade kill. I am using the Shinobu's Vow gauntlets here. Oh, wow. There we go. Nice little headshot kill like that right there he's right there oh I thought I had that third shot I thought I had it lined up pretty well what come on down jeez okay well blade ain't what it used to be that's for sure Oh yes. When it comes to rocket launchers, I feel like there's still just, there's truth and there's everything else. Yeah, can't get away from that. Can't get away from that. Clash. Bravo team. There he is. Come on. Where you at? Got him. Nice. So that is the general philosophy of how I want to use this hand cannon. It's like, uh, hey, there's another headshot. Nice. But typically I'm going to want to try and flop a skip grenade at somebody like this dude over here. Oh. Well, get him. He's just hiding back there. Oh, just the assist. Somebody else back here. What's he doing? Is he being bad? Not a nice guy. There we go. Got another kill. I'm happy with that. Not a lot of impact. Not a lot of range. But if you're team shouting with other people, you can get some kills. Try the same type of thing. Yeah. There we go. Another kill. Get out. Oh, I'm dead. Yeah. <laughs> As I was floating up in the air with my blink, I said, I'm going to die. And I did. More efforts like that, and we might just win this. Hey, our team won. <laughs> Sit down. <laughs> so what do I think about the How Dare You Hand Cannon? Uh, it is completely meh. 
but it's not just this hand cannon. Anything in this archetype of high rate of fire, low impact hand cannon is pretty much awful these days. And you don't see a lot of people using them specifically for that reason. You know, I hate on sticky grenades, but players are going to use the lowest time to kill item and a sticky grenade kills in one shot with no skill whatsoever. So, hey, why not use sticky grenades, right? Same thing with hand cannons. Uh, last word has always been great because of low time to kill. Ice Luna and Palindrome have the long range with the good impact. Hand cannons like this are just eh. There's nothing to them. But it's a change of pace, and because of that, and I like the variety in Destiny, I'm going to jump back into some Clash with the How Dare You Hand Cannon. Good work.